How you doing, everybody? This is Mike Coleman. I am here with Renette McCurry, uh, who's been inducted in the Women's uh, Softball Hall of Fame this year. Uh, I want to hear about Renette's career. So tell me a little bit about uh, where you started, Renette. Okay. Um, I actually started playing softball on, like, Sears Playlot, the, the ground. I actually played on concrete. And then from there, I went to organized ball, playing like at Columbus Park and okay. Washington Park, Forest Park. And what team? Uh, teams like Forest, um, Sloan was the co-ed team, Players was a co-ed team. Okay. My original softball team was uh, Forest. Okay. Played with them many years. That's why I actually started my career. In what year? Oh, hmm, late 80s. Late 80s, all yes. right, all right. And how did you guys compete against everybody else? Were you guys winning all of the championships? Uh, we were a team to be reckoned with. We, okay. were, we were basically really known for what we did on the softball field, so okay. a lot of teams feared us. All yeah. right, all right, good, good, good. Well, we uh, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, welcome Thank you. to the Hall of Fame, Thank and uh, we're looking forward to the ceremony uh, this April. Thank you. All right. SSA broadcast here, 2016 Hall of Fame. Here's the guy from 93 to current, Mr. Tony Prochensky. Tony, I met you way back when Splinters won it in Kingman, Arizona. You remember those days? Yeah, I remember 1991. It was a long time ago and really hot that tournament was. It was great. I mean, we had Mastari on that team. You were in left field, and the team you played was Lettuce, and I don't think you were on that team at that time. This is Tommy Dunnelson here, the, 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 the superstar from... I call from Bridgeport. Tommy, congratulations. It's going to be fun, this, this banquet, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, and that, back then in uh, Arizona, I was with uh, Jinx, and we lost to... And tell them what happened in that game, if you can remember, to, for the fans. You guys had a triple play pulled against you. Yeah, we, uh, I believe it was the whips we were playing. We had our first two guys on. We pinch hit a guy that likes to take the ball to right field, and he decided to take a ball down the third baseline, and... Mr. Around the Horn became his nickname, Matt. Triple play, and then you guys did not get to the final game. That was it. Oh, that was it. That was it for us after that. And then Splinters, of course, has won some great games. The great game against Carpet Country where you lost. I don't know if you were on that team or not. That was a tough one. You remember that yeah. year? Yeah, I remember that year. That was a, that was a tough loss. I think Mustari was gone, and uh, they beat us with, uh, I think, believe, a couple homers in the last inning. They did, so... That's Tony Prochensky. That's the great Tommy Duddleson. We'll see him at the banquet April 16th. George Bliss for SSA Broadcasts. We're here today with two new inductees into the 16-inch Hall of Fame. My name is Tony Rival, and here on my right is Dennis Andritzis, the Greek as he's known, and Tony Velasic also going in. Longtime Sobe players, manager, and we're going to do a little interview, and as long as I uh, have Dennis here, I'm going to make sure he doesn't talk too long, otherwise I'll pull the plug. Dennis, congratulations on being inducted, and I'd like you to say a few words and what your feelings are, and uh, let's hear from you. Thank you, Tony. appreciate it. I'm very, I'm very honored to uh, be inducted into the Hall of Fame, and it's the Hall of Fame's 20th year. It's also the 50th year since we won our first national title. And uh, it, it's not so much about the titles, it's about the great guys that we played with all these years. The Barakas brothers, Surma, Rybel, Hornacek, and uh, all these guys were older than me, and I try to live up to their expectations to the best of my ability. One important thing that Dennis just mentioned that I stress, and we all do. As he mentioned, it's 50 years since we won our first world. But more, more, more importantly, even today, all of us are still close. We have dinners together, we play cards together, and it hasn't changed from the way we were when we were young and we're playing until now we're old and still enjoying each other. I also like to introduce Tony Velasic manager of the American Rivet Sobe team, and uh, congratulations, Tony, and uh, happy to have you in and be a fellow inductee. I'd like you to have a few words and give your opinion. Thank you. Uh, well, thank you, Tony. Uh, I do appreciate being inducted into the Hall of Fame. It's uh, quite an honor, and uh, 
it's this team running this team was quite an honor. American River team I didn't have to manage much and what kind of managed itself there. Every ball player was a great ball player. He had a I think one of the best defensive teams ever to be combined for to, 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 to play 16 inch softball. Uh, we 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 lost a few of our best ball players, uh, the Barakas brothers, and uh, uh, we still have quite a few that are in their well into their eighties, which is like uh, Eddie Surma and Tony Rival here himself. And like Tony said, we were a team, and we're still a bunch of friends. We still hang around together. We play cards together. Uh, we do everything we possibly can together. So uh, I want to thank you. Thank, thank, thanks, thank, thank again the uh, 60 inch softball Hall of Fame, and. Uh, Here's Tony. Well, as both of them have said, and, and it really is a close, close team today. And the other thing that was mentioned when Tony said that uh, we were one of the best teams. With these two gentlemen going into the Hall of Fame now, our number now will be 12, uh, 13, I'm sorry, 13 that are, have been inducted into the Hall of Fame. So as was mentioned in the videos, and you see it, the Bobcats and the Rivet, or Sobies, was one of the greatest uh, comp, comp, competitive tournaments you could ever find in, in teams. I'd like to thank the Hall of Fame for everything they've done, and I enjoy everything with, about it. Thank you. SSA Broadcasts here with the Dr. Robazine. Congratulations. Wall of Fame, it should be a, a big fun dinner on April 16th, shouldn't it? Oh, yes. Uh, you know, it's a great honor to be in, uh, a member of the Wall of Fame in my new softball family. And I'm looking forward to the, uh, the dinner coming up on April 16th. It should be a great affair. Everyone should come out and join us. What about the Flamingos? Give me one story. Well, Flamingos, uh, uh, we had a great, uh, one story I can remember. One year we were playing in the championship where we were down eight runs going to the bottom of the last inning. And we had a coach named Johnny Hodges who played with uh, Percy Bobo Coleman and uh, Sweet Willie Johnson in the Hall of Fame, Sammy Taylor. And uh, we were down by eight runs and Johnny Hodges pulled us on the side. We, had our, we said our uh, mantra, you know, uh, all for one, one for all, let's win this game. And um, uh, uh, Hodges said, everybody get one hit at a time. And uh, we can do this. So we came back. We got eight runs in the in the, in the in the bottom of the seventh, tied the game up, and then one in the eighth inning. So that probably was, the most famous team in African American history, Senators Flamingos. You played with them. You, you have a, a long history. You have a lot of memories, I'm sure. Yes, it was a blessing to be playing with that team. Yeah, I, I got to play with some of the greatest softball players I ever played. You know, I you know I named Rick Mundy, who's in the Hall of Fame. Uh, Sweet Willie Johns, we call him Bumpstead. I mean, Saint Steve Kirby, uh, Percy Coleman is going in today. Uh, uh, Hammer and Hank Kemp, his brother Will Wicked Willie Kemp. Uh, yeah, great, great group of guys, and I've just been totally blessed to to have them as my teammates. Because without them as my teammates, I couldn't be here today. You just named the golden list of the greatest players in softball history. Mr. Robinson, congratulations. We're going to see you in April out of Drury Lane, okay? Let's yes, have a good time together. Yes, sir. Thank you. SSA broadcast from the 16-inch Softball Hall of Fame. Hi, everybody. This is Frank Lentine at the 16-inch at Softball Hall of Fame Museum, and I'm proud to announce and introduce Larry Butch Danley as our umpire for 2015's class. And here you are, Butch. I played this game for 43 years. It became the game of my life. You know, I played it for 18 years. I umpired it for 25. And I consider this to be the greatest honor that I have acclaimed. You know, and I thank God for everything that I've accomplished. And glad to be in the hall. April 16th. 2016 is the induction day gala and we'll see Larry there for sure. God bless everybody.